All right, what is up, you guys? It's Vendico coming at you with another video today. Uh, I know I said I was going to be making a video uh, about secret societies tomorrow, but tonight I decided that I should make a evil humans video because there's only one in that playlist. And I said, why not? You know, feel like doing it right now. Uh, I'm not too sure how long this one will be. It's probably going to be. Hand let me put in the script. Yeah, it's not going to be too bad. Uh, maybe six minutes, seven, ten. I don't know. But, um, yeah, so let's get into it. We're going to be talking about, uh, Lyndon H. LaRoche, er, uh, yeah, LaRoche Jr. Uh, okay, let's begin. Perpetual candidate for the U.S. President pre presidency, uh, far, far out conspiracy theorist Lyndon H. LaRoche remains one of the most controversial figures on the international scene. In 2004, Lyndon H. Roach, okay, we're just going to call him Lyndon, uh, not, born 1992 or 1922 made his fifth run for u.s president uh uh in that race he ran as a democrat in his first in his first run for presidency in uh 1976 he campaigned under the banner of the u.s labor party uh laroche is among one of the most controversial figures in the international scene to his followers he has the only ideology that will work in today's world and possesses a economic uh, theories that will turn America around. Uh, to his uh, detractors, LaRoche is a mad conspiracy, conspir con conspir conspirator. In his book Conspiracy, uh, Daniel Pipes states that the principal theme that has fueled LaRoche's uh, platforms for as many organizations, publications, and presidential campaigns is that a signal, a single, a single, uh, oligarchic. Uh, conspiracy has been bedeviled mankind since the dawn of history. Uh, its headquarters were first in uh, Babylon, then Rome, Venice, and now London. Uh, La Roche was convinced on the federal conspiracy theory charges in December, or con yeah, con on federal conspiracy charges in December, 1988, uh, and spent five years in prison. His followers condemned the trials as a political show trial, uh, comparable to the cases of France's Captain Alfred uh, Dreyfus on September 2nd, 1994, testifying before a commission investigating the same case for uh, former U.S. Attorney General Ramsey Clark commented that the case represented a broader range of, deliberating, uh, of deliberate cunning and systematic misconduct over, over a long period of time, utilizing the power of the federal government than any other prosecution by the U.S. government in, in my time or knowledge, he states. Uh, for years, uh, LaRoche's critics have denounced him as an anti-Semitic, eccentric conspiracy theorist whose cult of followers and borders on preaching fascist philosophy... Okay, if you don't know what fascist means, it means like a dictatorship in a sense. Um, actually, I was called a fascist the other day. Um, yes, follower? Okay. Cult followers borders on preaching fas fascist philosophy. They point to his claim that the Queen of England is the number one danger to humanity. Uh, his contention that were the beat that the Beatles were designed and shaped by British Psychological Warfare Division, and his belief that the Freemasons established the Jewish organization B'nai B'rith as a pro-slavery spy, um, spy ring providing intelligence to the South before the Civil War. At the same time, La Roche's beliefs or believes that the sovereign cognitive powers of the individual human mind are vi are validated by discoveries of, hum of physical principles that are identical in nature with those responsible for uh, the composition of metaphor and great compositions. Uh, in, in classical forms of poetry, music, and art, science and art are both subjective rather than objective, and new principles of science and new ideas are born as resolutions uh, of metaphor. These, LaRoche explains, were the lead uh, consideration in his confounding of the science, Scientific Fusion Energy Foundation during the mid-1970s, and his support for his wife Helga Zepp LaRoche's founding of the International Club of Life, uh, of the, yeah, of the International Club of Life, the International uh, Scheller, Scheller, Scheller Institute, devoted to the defense of the rights of humanity to progress, m m uh, Materi uh, morally, intellectually, and uh, materi yeah, mature, ma materiality. Uh, yeah, mature, mat yeah, yeah, materiality. Uh, my uh, Matthew Lennon's 
or Lyons, co-author with Chip uh, Burlett of the right-wing pub, uh, publicism or populism in America, Too Close for Comfort, told Joe Ireland of the Portland State University uh, Vanguard that since the early 1990s, the La Roches have promoted a kind of fake progressism. Um, they opposed kind of fake. Prog okay, they opposed both Gulf Wars, attacked the death penalty, and defended social welfare programs and civil rights. But their underlying political uh, philosophy is a base on conspiracy theories, uh, not a critique or systematic oppression. Lyndon LaRoche continues struggling against the grand conspiracy that, in his opinion, is made of Zionist, uh, Jesusist, Christians, uh, Freemasons, the Rockefeller, fam Rockefeller family, the Rothschilds, environmentalists, drug traffickers, fundamentalists, Muslim, Orthodox Christians, uh, and the Benai Brith. Uh, that is... <laughs> that's quite the list there you got. Uh, so that's basically just... Zion yeah, Zionist... Christians, Freemasons, Rockefellers, Rothschilds, environmentalists, drug traffickers, fundamentalists, or fundamentalist Muslims, Orthodox Christians, and that's 11 types of groups that you got against there, buddy. Uh, anyway, I hope you had a good time. It was a pretty quick, nice flow to it. I had a good flow. I like those days. Uh, anyway, that will be all for tonight. Um, tomorrow, Secret Society video is coming out. Um, Hope you guys have a good day. Uh, I certainly did. And as always, be good to your people.